Good morning students welcome to basic grammar sessions before going into this grammar session let me clear the concept grammar what is grammar இலக்கணம் என்றால் என்ன ஒரு மொழியை பிழையின்றி பேசுவதற்கும் எழுதுவதற்கும் உறுதுணையாக இருப்பது இலக்கணம் கிராமர் இஸ் அ டூல் த்ரூ விச் அ லாங்குவேஜ் கேன் பி ஸ்போக்கன் ஆர் ரிட்டர்ன் விதவுட் மிஸ்டேக்ஸ் டுடேஸ் டாபிக் இஸ் சப்ஜெக்ட் அண்ட் ப்ரிடிகேட் எழுவாய் மற்றும் பயநிலை பிஃபோர் கோயிங் டு த டாபிக் Let me give the meaning of a sentence. A sentence is nothing but a group of words which gives us a complete meaning. One vacuum in the palace circle in the end of a circle is a complete meaning. What is subject then? What is the part of the sentence which names the person who is talking about? The part of the sentence which names the person, place or thing is called subject. சப்ஜெக்ட் ஒரு வாக்கியத்தில் நாம் குறிப்பிடும் ஒரு நபர் பொருள் அல்லது இடம் எழுவாய் என்று அழைக்கப்படுகிறது வாட் இஸ் அ ப்ரிடிகேட் பயநிலை என்றால் என்ன த பார்ட் ஆஃப் த சென்டென்ஸ் விச் சேஸ் சம்திங் அபவுட் த சப்ஜெக்ட் இஸ் கால்டு ப்ரிடிகேட் எழுவாயை பற்றி குறிப்பிடும் பகுதியே பயநிலை என்று அழைக்கப்படுகிறது Let's see few examples to understand the topic better. The first one is She gave me a bunch of keys. What is the subject and what is the predicate in the sentence? Let me give a hint to find out the subject easily. The part which answers the question who or what becomes the subject. Now look at the given sentence. She gave me a bunch of keys. So ask the question, who gave me a bunch of keys? The answer is she. So this word she becomes the subject as it answers the question who. And the remaining words, gave me a bunch of keys. This group becomes the predicate. the part which explains or says something about the subject so here gave me a bunch of keys it says and explains something about the subject she so this phrase becomes the predicate here let's see few more examples vegetables are good for health so what is subject here as i said already you can easily find out the subject by asking the question who are what so vegetables are good for health so what is good for our health it is vegetables so we can easily find out vegetables as the subject and the remaining words comes under predicate and the last example my younger brother is working in mumbai who is working in mumbai my younger brother so this word my younger brother so you should not take the first word alone as a subject it should give us a complete subject my younger brother so this gives the description for your brother my younger brother so this full concept this full phrase becomes a subject here and the remaining is working in mumbai this becomes the predicate so dear students hope you all must have understood the topic thank you for listening Stay home stay safe happy learning